the microphone audio might be a little bit fucked up in this tiny little vlog I did. But I just made a little vlog like a few days ago. So I decided I'll throw it up on the channel. I'm just talking about just talking about a bunch of shit. Got a little story time in there. Got a little bit of advice in there. And just check it out. I just wanted to say the microphone quality's a little butt on it. Um, not the whole time. Not the whole time. There might be, there's just certain segments where it's a little muffled. That's it. Anyways, get to the video. What's good, everybody? What's good, individuals? It's your boys A Digital. Coming to you with a little vlog. Trying to catch some sunlight on this good day. We got the greenery behind me. It's looking good. I'm feeling good. And today I wanted to talk about one thing in specific. And it was something that I had to remind myself of recently. And that's simply taking things for granted. Stop fucking taking shit for granted. You, whew, you might think, you know, you don't have much right now. Or, you know, say you're working a job pay to, paycheck to paycheck and you might not know exactly what you want right now or so on and so on. Or you're working towards what you want right now. And um, sometimes you might be getting down on yourself and not um, uplifting yourself. Just getting down on yourself. Telling yourself, like, are the things that I want to achieve possible? And... Um, You might also think that if you, well, I wanted to say that yes, they are possible, and also that you need to be able to just take a look around you, take a look at the things you have in your life, you know. I could assume that if you're watching this video that you probably have a phone or a laptop, um, you probably have your own room which is something that many people take for granted, or even if you share a room, you have your own bed, which is something a lot of people can, um, can say they don't even have. They don't even have their own mattress to, to lay on at night. I would just say, take a look around you. I mean, here's for example, I'm outside looking at all this. It's beautiful, man fucking nice to look at all this shit you know to just clear your mind and you know if you have two legs be grateful that you can walk a problem i'm seeing recently you know you got people got or all four of their limbs and they walk around and move around less than people that have one leg today i'm just here to remind my future self in case i ever get down and not realize what I have in the current moment and to let you guys know watching to just take a look around for a second and really look at the good stop looking at the negative of course you know there's outside forces that are probably negative in your life because we all deal with negativity that's how the earth works that's how this world works and you just got to be able to look at the good more often more often than not and I get it, it's so easy to look at the negative. You go on to social media all damn day, then you're gonna look at the negative within yourself. The birds are chirping. It's sunny out for me. There's nothing I could really complain about right now. And the thing is, I'm sure there are things I could complain about, but it's more like there's nothing I need to be complaining about right now. There's nothing directly right in my way. Sometimes you just have to sit back, be patient, and understand that you got this, you know? You got whatever's coming towards you, you know? You can handle whatever bullshit's thrown at you. You can take a fuck, you could do a double, triple backflip over that shit. You don't need to allow these outside forces bring, bringing you down. You don't need to let them do any of that. Take a look around for a second. You know, that's the most simple advice I could give. I'm young. I'm 18 years old. Obviously, I'm not here to give every single advice on how, to, how you should live your life because I'm figuring that out on my own. 
So today is just me talking to y'all and letting y'all know that y'all need to remind yourselves that things aren't as bad as your head's portraying them to be. They aren't. You might be super stressed out about something. And the moment, there might be something extremely stressing you out. And I would say, time and patience. Patience is a hard thing to learn. It's something I'm still trying to learn day by day. I've had my impatience, patient moments recently. Look at that. And yeah. There's no reason for you to be completely down on yourself every single day. You should never be down on yourself every single day. And that's just how the human mind works. We're so inclined to negativity because there are negative forces outside in the world. But there's no point in paying attention to these negative forces if they do nothing but bring you down. You know? You gotta be able to look at the, uh, look at the positive attributes you have as a human, you know? But listen, you got it. We all got it. And there's some real assholes in the world that have lost sight of that and have just decided to stay assholes. Man, I had this fiend. I was in the hood the other day. This fiend walks up to me. I'm about to, um, I'm at the front desk of a convenience store. I'm about to, you know, get my snacks or whatever. Get a little, uh, you know what I'm saying? But he's like, Hey, ask her if I can grab a lighter. My first thought's like, ask her yourself. But then I was like, hey, can you grab a lighter for my boy? And <laughs> the first thing he says, he's like, why would you say this for me, you lame ass? Sit th and I turn around and I take a good look at this man's face and he's got one eye drooping down heavier than the other. He's got acne all over his face. He's kind of stumbling a little bit when he walks. Yet he's still wearing jeans and like a nice looking belt probably just for the image um you know i really just thought of course i hit him with a, the fuck's wrong with you and then i walked away and then he he was still talking trying to press me i wasn't having any of that i was just moving on with my day i know within myself that i'm way i'm way happier than that person is so another negative outside force that could be bringing you down is people and luckily, I don't have a fiend snapping at me every single day. But if there's someone in your life that's not, at least, if you feel that there's someone in your life not treating you with the respect that you deserve, then maybe it's time you keep your distance from them. And you focus on the good people in your life. You know, the people that motivate you, or, you know, the hard workers in your life, people... Some of your friends probably working their, their asses off, you know? I got some homies working their asses off. It's good to focus on people like that. You know, the ones that, the ones that don't talk down to you. The ones that don't say, say little things that are talking down on you. You gotta focus in on the good. That's really an important key you should follow. Like, see, let me... Let's try and get a view down here. I seen a raccoon. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. There's poison ivy and shit. My ass fucked up in here. Oh, beautiful, beautiful view. We got tires. Oh, let's show a fuck ton of tires. Despicable. It's despicable axe. I was trying to show y'all the trail down there. Got some gas on you? I mean, sure. If, if, if that's what you like doing, you know, go on and walk, smoke some gas. You know, and even if you are completely broke right now, like me, <laughs> it's fine. You gotta sit back and patiently, patiently wait and put the work in. And you'll know that one day, you're not gonna be broke. I'm not gonna be broke one day. And plenty of days after that, you know? You gotta patient, you gotta believe in yourself, and you gotta sit back and patiently wait. And don't take things for granted. Zay Digital, signing out. Have a good one, y'all.